What is going on guys? Brethren here and I got a pretty awesome cannon to show you guys. This is actually, this is the best cannon that I've ever seen on Minecraft Xbox 360 and actually shoots the farthest and the highest without it actually disappearing because uh, there's an issue with the Xbox to where if it goes a certain distance that it actually will pretty much just disappear because it goes too high for I guess the Xbox to read or something like that so basically this is a PC remake cannon of course the original creator will be in the description below but uh, as you can see here the original has four layers of TNT here and I will show you guys how to actually make this but it has four layers and then when you actually shoot it off as you can see here four layers is just too much for the Xbox to handle and it won't even render it. It actually goes too high in the sky and pretty much just disappears. So basically for the Xbox, we and we've been testing me and Bolts the Clown. Uh, his link will be in the description below as well. He uh, helped me out quite a bit with this. And we were up all night pretty much testing this out as you can see from all the craters and whatnot. But um, as you can see here though, three layers is pretty much the most that you can get out of this cannon that the Xbox will actually handle and we did make a wall there so you can see now let's go ahead and shoot this off and we'll let's see where it lands here oh and as you can see there it uh, landed a perfect hole almost in the center there um, but uh, not quite so anyways guys this is an and it also shoots sand I forgot to mention um, let's go ahead and load it back up one more time Whoop load it up here and we'll do one here and I think if I'm not mistaken that two is the most you can do for sand but let's go ahead and give it another layer and let me just make sure again so let's load it up we'll send this on three and three two one go oh and uh, actually with sand what it does is really weird is it actually hits the wall and when it falls it'll fall about 20 blocks and then it'll turn into um, you know not even it won't look like this it'll actually look as if it got broke down or something like that which I thought was pretty pretty weird so let's go ahead and we'll put some sand back in this let's go ahead and layer this up with just two layers here which will be plenty and then we'll put some more sand back in here and we'll fire it off one more time and let's go over here where we can actually see it and as you can see there it hits and it disappears which I haven't really figured out why it does that see that's the piece of sand right there I haven't really figured out why it does that on the Xbox I don't really know it's pretty weird but uh, anyways guys I thought this was pretty awesome so I wanted to show you guys this is definitely the best cannon that I have seen on Minecraft Xbox 360 so far so basically I'm gonna show you guys how to build it alright guys so starting off what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna place your two pistons and then right beside the two pistons on both sides a block of your choice you will put three high followed by the redstone torches on the third block now it doesn't matter about the redstone torches if you want to fire sand but as far as firing TNT you will need those and then you're gonna to want to put two repeaters both on setting four right here followed by six repeaters all six on setting four as well and then you're gonna to want to put some redstone here followed by some blocks here with a lever or not a lever but a button rather and then some more uh, redstone around here and you'll have different layers here you have one two three and then four and to be honest with you like I was saying you don't even need this fourth layer simply because uh, it doesn't even really work on the Xbox so pretty much all you need guys is just three layers here as you can see with a staircase uh, behind it so that it steps up the redstone to all the different layers it's pretty self-explanatory and then on uh, both sides of the pistons you'll have one two three blocks here and then one two three blocks here and that's a double wide and just single down and you'll want to put water in that and then once you put your TNT here you want to place your TNT you don't want to place it on this block here just one two three four five six come up one two three four five six and then one two three four five six alright and that pretty much completes it guys uh, and I don't know what it is about it actually hitting water but the TNT actually kind of falls into each other 
and kind of just makes for one big catastrophic explosion and as you can see there I didn't even load it up <laughs> derp so let's go ahead and load it up one more time guys one two three four five six and there's no need to count anymore because I've said one two three four five six quite a few times so let's go ahead and give it one more go and let's see here if we can get a better shot oh Oh, and it looks like both of them actually hit this time, but both on the outside corners. Anyways, though, guys, it's pretty simple to make. I hope you guys did enjoy the tutorial. If you did, guys, please make sure to uh, give the video a thumbs up. And like I said, the original creator's channel will be in the description as well as Bolts' channel. Make sure to go over and show some love to them as well. Anyways, I hope you did enjoy the video, and I'm out, guys. Thanks for watching, and peace out.